Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to apologize in advance for this video. Um, yesterday, if anyone watched my video yesterday, you may have heard me saying that I wasn't feeling very well. Um, well, not long after that, I tested positive for COVID. So um, I apologize if I sound a little bit like stuffy because my nose is blocked, my throat hurts. Um, and I apologize for looking like I'm dead. Um... <laughs> But yeah, I'm uh, up early. I'm excited to watch Kenobi episode three. Um, so yeah, let's let's do this. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Dude. Dude! Dude! Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> Who would have ever thought we would have seen Vader again? Oh shit! Oh, oh my god, he's so intimidating. Oh! I like that we're not like completely stuck on Tatooine for this entire show. Like, I like that we're elsewhere. We're going to random planets. A nice change. Bro. Ben. Ben. Holy fuck. God, just she's so hot. Even just the way she walks. Oh my god. Dude, this place is insane. Yeah, you better stop in your tracks and let her walk past. Yeah. God fucking damn it. She's... Oh, I love her so fucking much. That's what you think, buddy. Spoiler alert, it's not gonna happen. Hey there, I'm Freck. Freck seems nice. Hello. Damn, he didn't say hello there. You know, Freck seems lovely. If anything happens to him, then I'm gonna sue. I'm gonna be very upset. Uh oh. It's fine, just Jedi mind trick them. It's okay. I mean, you pretty much did find him, you just don't know it yet. Sometimes when I look at Luma, I see her mother's face. Well, that part wasn't a lie. We all miss her very much. A couple of strangers. But you might want to check them out. No, I'm trusting you, Freck. I feel like putting the hood up makes you more sus like sus. Honestly. What is protocol 23? Ah. Oh. Protocol droid, I see. Let's go, Kenobi! Please don't hurt Freck! As long as Freck doesn't get hurt! Oh! Man's just got split in half! Uh oh. Oh no, Leia's gonna die! Oh no! I was gonna say, you could've just went around it, Kenobi. Uh-oh. Ma'am. Also, ma'am. 
Yes, queen, let's go. Unexpected. I can't tell if she's actually an Imperial officer. Or whether she's just in the uniform. Okay, but I love her already. I love her so much. Oh, Lola and Ned besties for life. Someone let Ned speak. Give him a voice, please. Smuggling younglings. Uh, Quinlan smuggling younglings. Oh my god. Hey! I'm talking to you. Dude. Mans is holding a fucking hammer ready to beat the shit out of some bucket heads. Let's go, Ned. Dude is armed and ready. Oh no, is he here? not end the episode here please oh my god oh my fucking god oh my god holy fuck no mercy no mercy at all holy fuck he just snapped that kid's neck bro he's just fucking killing everyone Oh my god, he's gonna look right at him. Holy fucking shit! Oh my god. That's the greatest thing I've ever seen in my life. Oh my fucking god. Holy shit. Oh, he finally ignited it! Ah! God, the lighting in this is beautiful. Holy shit, that's the most intimidating thing I've ever seen in my life. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I am what you made me. Don't. You hurt Ned. Oh. Oh. oh my god. Oh, this is the most beautiful thing. Dude, never in a million years did I expect to see this kind of shit. I... Oh my god. I mean, if he really wanted to kill Obi-Wan, he would have force choked him to death by now and snapped his neck. Oh, I say... I... Oh my god. Fuck. Oh, dude. That was sick. Oh my god. I don't even have any words for he had help with his super plan. No. They really said you're gonna go through what I went through. You're gonna burn like I did. Oh god. This just got so much worse. Holy f shit. Dude, okay, I don't even know how to put into words what we just witnessed, what I just saw, what just happened on my screen. Is this real life? Am I dreaming? Have I, like, have I died and gone to heaven? Like, 
Holy fucking shit. I, I feel like I barely give any commentary that episode. I feel like I was just sat there like the entire time. I didn't know what to say. I feel like there was nothing to say. I was just trying to appreciate and take in the beauty of what I was seeing and the 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 angst and the oh I just oh my god I oh my god I I, I don't even know how to to, to go to go about this so obviously having Hayden Christensen back is beautiful seeing him in the Vader suit seeing him like as the helmet was coming down as well seeing like his suit get put together it was one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen having that voice James Earl Jones's voice back oh my god God, I just want to give that man a hug. I just, oh, I was so happy. It's so beautiful, and and the music that was playing, like this is this it. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I'm so I'm such a loss for words. Like my brain isn't working properly, but I'm just at such a loss. I just so much just happened, and okay. So taking it back to when obviously Kenobi and Leia were in little like the little hideout place and they fucking had Quinlan Voss's name that's such a cool little easter egg I would love to go back and like see if I can read like if I can pause on like the walls and read all the names um because they're all written in Orabesh and I can kind of read Orabesh um um so I'm gonna go back at some point and see if I can like read uh like the names and stuff um but Quinlan Voss is this is this like a hint towards maybe you know uh, a show about Quinlan and Ventress, please? Because Ventress is like one of my favorite people of all time. Gimme, 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 gimme! Is that like a subtle hint? You know, um, like their their novel being made canon or is it canon? I don't, I don't know. Their novel being at least brought into live action, if it is canon. Um, please, that would be nice. Um, but yeah, oh my god. And like Vader was Vader was not showing any mercy to anyone. Like those people he just fucking force choked and snapped their necks and dr like dragged them across the floor. He's really in his like angry time. Like this is like peak I feel like this is peak Vader. Like this is just, you know, not long after he's, you know, gotten into his suit, not long after he's turned to the dark side. So this is like this is him at his like worst, I feel. Um and oh my god fucking seeing him in his like jedi robes when obi-wan was walking through the field and he sees him over in the distance with his like hood up and stuff oh my god it's so good to see hayden christensen again like it's it's surreal i really never expected this to to happen like i just oh my god i love star wars i fucking love everything and reva i so right we got to touch on this just 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 because it's important. If y'all are some of the people, if any of you guys, I know I trust you guys, you are all wonderful, but anyone out there who is sending hate towards uh Moses, uh Reva's actor, y'all need to just I'm going to send Vader your way. Like y'all need to stop. I don't know why I put a SH at the front of that. Y'all need to stop. You'll need to stop and reevaluate your life. There is no space for racists in the Star Wars community. And there's also no space for toxicity and hate. You're allowed to dislike whatever you want, but if it's on terms of race or gender, then get the fuck out. You're not welcome here. Um I think I think Reva is such a cool character and she is incredibly hot um and i love everything about her i don't really understand the hate towards the character um i mean i love inquisitors and i love women <laughs> so you know you kind of get where i go with this but she's i just i just think she's a really really cool character she's a cool inquisitor she is motivated by her goal to stand side by side with vader like that's that's obvious for someone who was once a jedi who's become an inquisitor like what what else do you expect from her you know um but my god i oh, oh, i'm not over this i'm never getting over this this is just ah 
What else am I supposed to say about this? I don't know. I need to rewatch this immediately. I need, well, I need to take a break and gather my thoughts and pick my heart up off the floor. Because Vader ripped that shit out and stepped on it in a good way. That was, again, the colors, the music, the sounds, the, the camera angles, everything in that scene was so beautiful. And, like, Vader wanting, like, Obi-Wan to feel the pain that he went through, which, I mean, I'm not going to blame him. It's understandable. If someone made you fucking burn in lava and, like, cut off your limbs, you're going to want them to feel the same kind of pain, especially if that person was, like, your your brother or father figure. You know? It's kind of like, obviously, Obi-Wan didn't do it on... But like, you know, it, it wasn't... This wasn't, like, Obi-Wan being like, oh, my God, someday this Padawan of mine, I'm going to make sure he burns. Like, that's obviously not what happened, but it happened. So, honestly, yes, I do understand why Vader is wanting to do this. Um, But before he did that, I thought, like, well, if he wanted to kill him, he would have done it by now. But it never crossed my mind until it happened that he was going to, like, torture him. I, I don't know why that didn't cross my mind. I just instantly... You, you see Vader and you instantly think, death not torture. So, yeah, I'm I'm just that was uh I'm going to go cry. I'm going to lie in bed and cry. Um but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you think. Um let me know your opinions on this episode. Um uh, and yeah, I I'm sorry again that I all I did was shout oh my god, oh my god, holy fucking shit. Um but what else are you supposed to say in those moments? Like, damn, you got some nice shoes. Like, what, what the fuck you meant to say, you know? Um, I think I've gone loopy. I think COVID has made me gone loopy. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode, and I will see you guys next week for the next episode. I have recorded my reactions, by the way, to, um, to like, the celebration uh, trailers that came out. Um, so I will upload them over the next couple of days so that it's not, like, so that it's not clogging up my channel. Um... But yes, thank you guys so much for watching and uh, may the force be with you.